we are here in our Ustream channel and I'm going to show you a little bit more beyond the basic stuff that you can do with Ustream. First thing is I want to kind of show you over here about this chat window. The default is the social stream which isn't a lot of use to you but if you click on chat what will happen is this will be an area where people that come to your channel can chat with you. So if you're running a broadcast you can chat live with the audience as they're in here in this chat channel. You can also pop that chat channel out so you can have it in a separate window. So that's a cool feature. Another thing you can do is share your channel. Um, I showed you before about the URL up here. You can share it that way or if you click on share you can share it to your Facebook account, your Twitter account if you've got one set up for your school um, and you can embed this um, channel into a web page or a blog. It's really simple to do. This is how I do field trips in, in my school. We will do a Ustream live video from a field trip and we will embed this code right into our web page. So all parents have to do is come to our web page and check out the video. I would uh, I would encourage you to do a larger size, you know, the bigger the better. And then all you do is copy it and put it into your web page. Now speaking of uh, field trips and whatnot, there, is, there are mobile apps for this Ustream. If you've got an iPod Touch or an iPhone, there is a or an iPad, there is an app, a Ustream app, you just look for it on the App Store, you can install it, and even in your pocket, you can live stream, and it works really well. In fact, that's how I do a lot of live streaming, is I do it right from my iPhone. I just pull up the app, put in my account, and start streaming, and it pops it right into my channel online so people can see. Alright, speaking of our channel, I'm going to come back here to our dashboard, and I want to show you how to customize your theme a little bit more. So, what you're going to do is I'm going to go to the channel, I'm sorry, I'm going to go down here to account settings, and I'm going to, I'm sorry, I'm going to go to manage my channel, my fault, and I'm going to go down here to design. And I'm going to click on I want to customize my theme. So down here you can upload a custom image, whether it's a, a picture from your school or whatnot, and you can use that as your background here in Ustream. You can tile it, which is basically doing it over and over again. And you can also change the background color if you don't want to do an image. And you can change the text and the link color and save it here. Another thing I want to show you in your channel is your videos. I don't have any recorded videos on this account. But when you do have recorded videos, they're going to be here. This is where you can clean them out if you need to. You can delete them, you can rename them, you can share them from here. But that will be in your video section right here. I'm going to click on channel info in case you want to update your channel info you can do that here and another thing I want to make sure you can know how to do is you can create other channels so I'm going to do testing 2 and I just want to make sure that you see that you can have multiple channels whenever you're doing the service alright so that is it that is Ustream a really cool tool to use for your kids they can broadcast live you can broadcast live and you can use it with your school. Your kids will be really excited and your parents at your school will be really excited too that they can watch things online live as they happen. Alright, that's it for this video and I hope it helps.